Well, howdy, 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 nearly senior citizen here, greetings, boys and girls, and welcome to this. Me trying to quickly figure out where to put this pink bucket before uh, the camera starts. Oops, missed that timeline. Or not timeline, deadline. Am I centered? Not quite. Gosh darn it. There we go. Sort of. Anyway. Oh, I need to move this. The uh, cable for my keyboard was resting against the microphone. I'm sure that's made a wonderful sound. This is postcards from the edge. Postcards, to do it much more officially, from the edge. Not just in passing with my head turned to the side. Yes, indeed. I have a whole bunch of stuff. In some cases, I've kind of messed up a little bit, and I apologize. I've sort of... Um, I don't have your name all together right in front of me at the moment. I'm very sorry about that, but last night, Genoza, um, you had sent me a whole bunch of stuff. And of course, I've misplaced everything except for these dice that you sent me from the casino. I didn't misplace the shirt. The shirt is with all my other shirts tucked away. All my shirts that I've gotten from wonderful subscribers. And so it's unfortunately tucked away as well as the calendar is put away and uh but i've got the the dice you sent from the actual casino i got the little letter thingy so thank you very much i'm sorry that i messed up like that i'm a horrible person talking about being a horrible person i also hopefully oops well i misplaced where these two things came from. Actually, I think I know where this one came from, so I'm going to talk about that one in a bit. But this one I'm unsure of. No, this one must have been. Yes, it's Reno, Nevada. It's from um, Annalisa Genosa. Some, I'm trying to remember. My memory sucks. The fact that I'm even partly there is amazing. But thank you. That's. I'm sorry that I got mixed up. This is a spinny part, so it's actually pretty awesome. I love these things. Thank you so very, very much. I have to put that in there. But I have a whole bunch of... Now, when I say a whole bunch, this is a couple weeks worth since my last one. And altogether, this and the postcards is it. Um, things are falling back down to normal with uh, the mail that I get at my... Uh, my post office box, which means, you know, I'm getting dropping back down to uh, one or two cards a week. Pretty soon, I've, uh, I imagine it's going to fall back down to really normal, where it's just one or two cards a month. So, that happens. As long as there's something, though, I'll keep showing them. If I never get enough for a full one of these again, I'll be putting them in the morning, morning vlog. But I have this cool card. I am not quite sure where it's from. But look at that. Oh, this picture is from India. I do not know if the person who sent this is from India. But if so, way cool. Awesome. Thank you so very much. That is a cool card. Oh, wow. Here's another cool one, too, from uh, Alaska. That's pretty cool. There's moose. Moose everywhere. Moose are dangerous. They will kill you and eat you. I Actually, I don't know if they'd eat you. But there's another one. It's cool. Very cool. I love snow. Actually, I don't know. Moose might eat you. I mean, they found out to everybody's shock and surprise that uh, herbivores will eat meat when they can. Like, they wanted to find out, you know, which animals were eating carcasses first. And so what they were doing is they would put an animal carcass chained in the forest with cameras on it nighttime cameras and then they'd see which animals came out to eat the meat they were shocked when it was the deer and the squirrels that came to eat the meat first I mean, they came out and they chowed as, as much as they could and then came the big meat eaters 
but what a surprise that even the herbivores will do it puts a different um perspective on you know when there's like farm pictures where or short videos where you'll see like a cow that's eating grass and then munch 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 and there's baby chickens running around and then munch munch and then the cow goes munch and eats a baby chicken and then goes back to eating you know grass it's not an accident they're doing it on purpose they're they eat meat when they can what a surprise but here's a cool one. Uh, I do not know where it's from, but oh, cool. It's a picture. Uh, it's in Korea. Awesome. Thumbs up. Thank you so very much for the awesome card. And then, oh, here's an Australian card. I have a lot of people sending me cards and things from Australia. So thank you so very much. Oh, here's another one. Ah, uh, hi, Jamie. I just left a comment for you on uh, in the comment section. Thank you for the for the uh, card. And then there's oh, what the heck is this? Oh, they're penguins. It looks like yeah. May these penguins lighten up your day. Yay, penguins! Thank you so very much. They do. Penguins are awesome. I'm so sorry that we're killing them all. The charm of Yangshao landscape. Oh wow. Oh wow. I don't know where that is, but that is a cool picture. Whoa, thank you so much. And then, wow, look at this one. This is a cool photo. And <laughs> you were close. It, it, on the back, it's for Mr. Walter Robin. It's William, but that was close. I mean, I'm not definitely not gonna dog you. Oh, speaking of dogs, I'm actually gonna show this one. This is one that was from my parents. <laughs> picture of doggies on it oh and then yes this is the uh, Sands Regency uh, I'm very sorry that I, I didn't lose them but I have tucked away the shirt and such thank you so very much though it's very awesome greatly greatly appreciated that is those now we have smaller letters that can or might be opened like this one this one didn't come with any words on it, but it's got, oopsie, well, aside from the return address on the back that you don't need to see, but it's uh, like all these, I guess they're Mexican flags. And then look at this cool keychain thingy. It's one of those little you spin them and then, you know, they go bong, 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 bong. I mean, it doesn't really do that. This is the keychain thing. But that's really awesome. Thank you so very, very much. That is so very cool. As soon as I get a place that I can call my own, all of my keychains are going up on Dowling or lanyards or something so that everyone can see them because they're so awesome. I just have to keep those out so that they can be seen. Okay, there it is, back inside the envelope. And then there's a little card here I'm not going to show. It's, oh, Bismarck, North Dakota. And on the back, <laughs> the only normal people are the ones you don't know very well. <laughs> I can agree with that. Thank you so very, very much. I'm gonna be opening these later on. Like, here's another card. Oh, in fact, this one, it's a card card, so I can pop this one open real quick make sure that nothing okay I can't show the inside but thank you so very very much the inside of the card was awesome I thank you so very much it is greatly greatly appreciated that is a very awesome card the wishes inside are beautiful thank you and then I have another one gotta be careful Oh, it says, feel free to show all this to your viewers. So I don't want to show the front address, but it's from Norway. Very cool. And here's a card. Oh, this is a beautiful picture on the front. Nice picture. Very cool. But it just says, you know, it's God you. Merry Christmas in Norwegian. Typical Norwegian Christmas is a, oh, the little guy is a Nissa. A, far, a farm spirit from Scandinavian folklore. 
But that's okay that it's late. Just like you said, it's probably going to be late. And it was a little bit, mostly for me. Oh, and it says, did you know that Norwegians celebrate Christmas on Christmas Eve but not Christmas Day? You know, that's the way I'd actually like to see that. I think kids should, you know, open up all their presents Christmas Eve and everybody do things on Christmas Eve. And then you sleep and then you have the next day as a day to just relax. Instead of doing it all Christmas Day and, and all that. I'm weird though, so I'm not like a typical anybody <laughs> I've actually opened up this little card before it was just a, a little doggy I just wanted to show a little doggy on it thank you so very much quite uh, quite quite awesome here's another card uh, I mean letter it's from Albany New York that's the postmark I'm not going to show the actual um, letter uh, information part of it and then here's one that's uh, Portland Oregon Thank you very much. Little ones like this, I'm just gonna open up at a, a different time. But here's another one. Yep. I can't tell what the postmark is, but if you recognize that, thank you very, very much. There's a big card inside. And then, well, this one's kind of torn or open already. Did I do this one already? No. This one. Oh, I guess this one, I don't know. This one might be, it says from Jamie. So, I don't know. But thank you very, very much. Quite awesome. And then there's another one with uh, South, South Jersey, New Jersey. Yeah, little card there, Christmas card says, keep making videos in 2017. You bet your bippy. You bet your bippy. Holy smokes, that's the 1970s speaking there. I think they just called. They want their catchphrase back. So, man, that's, I plan on making videos forever and ever and ever. I'm just trying to carefully open this one. It's from Australia as well. It says you can open this. These are Christmas cards. Okay. Well, I mean, show these. I imagine that that's what they wanted me wanted to say. Oh, and these are. Look at all these. These are just, these are a ton of Christmas cards. Thank you so very much. Wow, I mean, they're literally a ton of Christmas cards. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is awesome. Now, I have two bigger ones. <clears throat> this one, yeah, this is the one that had that, um, what did I do with it? Where did I set it? Oh, it's right here. They sent me a huge package, uh-oh. Okay, there's nothing on the front that will uh, identify who it was. Cool. This is sent to me from England, where part of the things was there is a handmade folding plastic comb. Came in a package. It's got the, uh, the packaging for the packages in here as well. It's the Kent Finest handmade folding comb so that was pretty cool right there and then hokey smokes the rest of the stuff in here it's it's packed it's like you could kill a rhinoceros with this this package I'd hate to kill an actual rhinoceros considering how few of them there are left in the world but if I had to defend myself against a rampaging rhinoceros, I could have used that. Oh, look at this. There's like a little pin. A little hamster. Running on a wheel. And then a... Uh, <laughs> a Yu-Gi-Oh card. A rescue hamster. And then there's... Because I opened all these up. A... Uh, it looks like a coaster. A runtime error <laughs> which is funny as all get out oh and then this was awesome look at this it's got a thing where it talks about you know what your name means and all that but then on the other side it's a one of those 3d card things you can't really tell on there but it is 3d and things move it's quite 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 freaking awesome thank you so very very much these were all individually wrapped because the fact that the uh, comb is already out, you could tell that I'd already opened it. 
but it's got like a, a googly eyed hamster picture. <laughs> Thank you so very much for the card. Will you just say thank you so very much and and you, you know you and including the cat. So thank you so very very much. And in, there's like this other card. <laughs> thank you much for all of this stuff. It's absolutely incredible. Greatly greatly appreciated. And then there's two other things, Northumberland and Durham. So I've no doubt I pronounced both of those absolutely incorrectly but here's hoping the Durham I think is I got correctly without a problem it's the Northumberland one I'm quite sure I've done wrong oh, I gotta be careful there's there this side um, let's see if I can figure out how to open this one uh. My grip is not very strong anymore. My, the uh, abraded nerves, my abraded radial nerves, my grip on either side feels weak and just is not as strong anymore. So when I'm pulling on things like that, it, oh, I don't have the strength for it anymore. It drives me crazy. Oh, holy smokes. Oh, wow. Okay, this has, you know, there's nothing really uh, personal about it, but it's got a huge Australian landscapes calendar with a little diary thing here. Thank you so very, very much. Australia is another one of those countries that I would love to visit, but I would be absolutely terrified of dying from the, the uh, actual animals that live there. Oh, I, I'm sorry, look at this one that, that fell too. That is awesome. That was from the England package, the British package that came through. Thank you all so very, very much. I get more validation for my existence from the postcards and letters and packages from you people out there than I get from uh, family <laughs> here. I have to go upstairs or I can't even see my children. You know, they're just, my daughter wouldn't come down here anyway. My son would like to, but because of the clouds of cannabis smoke that fill the room down here, of which there are none, when I've had people come in to this place that don't smoke cannabis or cigarettes, and I've had them come in and I say, what do you smell? And they go, uh, nothing. I was like, I go, exactly, that's what you smell there's nothing down here there's no ro rolling clouds of cannabis smoke but the rolling clouds of cannabis smoke get my son high from secondhand smoke when he's down here yeah right so I don't get to see him life is life well thank you very very much it's quite quite awesome that you people send me these things I appreciate it to no end. You are all beautiful, wonderful people, and I thank you from the very bottom of my heart. You keep me grounded. You keep me on earth. Knowing that there are people out there that care for me is absolutely awesome. I'm not used to it. It's really different. I mean, my life has not been good. So it's really, really nice to get, uh, well, people actually caring. So thank you so very, very much. You take care. Have a great day today. I will see you on the flip side. And that, my friend, is a very good thing. Now, if you're curious, this is uh, American Sign Language when I do that. American Sign Language, A-S-L. It's, uh, you know, sign language. And that's the I, L, and Y when you finger spell. That's just short for I, love you put it together that's all it is so among family close friends it means literally I love you for among not family and not so close friends say internet friends it means thank you so much for being my friend I am very fond of you so you take care have a great day and I will see you on the flip side and that my friend is a very good thing.